ഹലോ വെൽക്കം ബാക്ക് നമ്മൾ ഫിന്നിനെ പറ്റിയായിരുന്നു പഠിച്ചുകൊണ്ടിരുന്നത് പല കേസ് ഓഫ് ഫിൻ ഉണ്ട് ലാസ്റ്റ് വീഡിയോയിൽ വി ഹാവ് ഡിസ്കസ് ദി ഫസ്റ്റ് കേസ് വേർ ദ ഫിൻ ഈസ് ഇൻഫൈനറ്റ്ലി ലോങ് സോ ഇൻ ദിസ് വീഡിയോ വിൽ ബി ഡിസ്കസിങ് ദി സെക്കൻഡ് ആൻഡ് തേർഡ് കേസ് ടുഗദർ ഇൻ സെക്കൻഡ് കേസ് യു ആർ ഹാവിങ് എ ഷോർട്ട് ഫിൻ വിത്ത് എൻസ് ഇൻസുലേറ്റഡ് ആൻഡ് ഇൻ ദി തേർഡ് കേസ് യു ആർ ഹാവിങ് എ ഷോർട്ട് ഫിൻ വിത്ത് കൺവെക്ട് ഹീറ്റ് ട്രാൻസ്ഫർ ഈസ് ഹാപ്പനിങ് അറ്റ് ദി എൻഡ് ഓർ simply ends are not insulated so these two cases will be discussing so case to short fin with the ends insulated here you are having a fin which is having a finite length which is denoted by l so analyzing the fin means you will be finding the temperature variable at any distance x which is measured from this base surface for uh, finding that you have conducted the heat transfer analysis and you have derived the basic heat transfer equation for fins which is dou square theta by dou x square minus m square theta equal to zero and this uh, theta solution is obtained as c1 e raised to mx plus c2 e raised to minus mx and if you are finding the uh, c1 c2 constant by using different boundary conditions for this case then you can obtain the exact solution for the temperature distribution or theta variable so boundary conditions are similar to the case one uh, at the end x equal to zero or at the base surface the temperature t will be same as temperature of this base surface t naught if t equal to t naught then you will be converting t in terms of theta excess temperature variable so first generally you are having theta general temperature excess temperature variable t is so theta is t minus t infinity so at x equal to zero theta can be named as instead of t it will be t not minus t infinity and t not minus t infinity at x equal to zero and we theta not and we will see in the next video and second condition is after length l which is short or finite fin it is in insulated insulated means there is no heat transfer is happening across this end or this is known as tip there is no heat transfer across the tip no heat transfer means temperature gradient will be zero that is dt by dx equal to zero since we are having the variable theta solution is in terms of theta you have to convert this dt by dx into d, uh, d theta by dx here theta equal to t minus t infinity then d theta by dx will be same as dt by dx as t infinity is uh, constant so you are having the variable dt by dx equal to zero condition will be becoming d theta by dx and where you are applying at x equal to l will be equal to zero these are the two boundary conditions if you are applying these two boundary conditions then you will be getting the solution uh, value of c1 and c2 then you can get obtain the final expression for temperature variable then you will be getting theta equal to theta not into cos h m into l minus x divided by cos h ml in the gitu this is the temperature variable and uh, otherwise this theta is represented as general t minus t infinity and this theta not can be represented as t not minus t infinity angane edda means t minus t infinity divided by t not minus t infinity i will be writing this t minus t infinity divided by t not minus t infinity will be equal to cos h into m into l minus x divided by cos h ml where this cos h is hyperbolic cosine functions aanu adu nammal pandu maths il padichittundu adu problem solve cheyumba hyperbolic cosine function edukka ariyanam calculator und use cheyan padikan and also ee case le there is also an expression for heat transfer occurring across the fin for this case and you will be getting that heat transfer for this case which is short fin with end insulated as square root of h into p into k into ac cross section area into t not minus t infinity into an expression kodu varum extra term which is tan h ml this is hyperbolic tan function this this is tan h into tan h of ml and that is all these are the expression so this is the temperature distribution and this is the heat transfer equation for this case where you are having a short fin with 
ends insulated. These are the two expressions. And this is given in data book also. I will be showing this in the chapter data book for uh, fins. So you are having fin with, you are having a uh, short fin with end insulated. General temperature variable T minus T infinity divided by T naught minus T infinity will be equal to cos HML minus X divided by cos HML. And the heat transferred by the fin, Q fin will be equal to root HPK into T naught minus T infinity into tan HML. Here and equations will derive in the kit. Next is the third case of fin. Third case of fin, third case is short fin with the convective heat transfer is happening across the end. So, this is the general solution for theta. Theta is equal to C1 into E raise to Mx plus C2 into E raise to Mx minus Mx. This is C1, C2 and C1, C2 will be obtained by applying the boundary conditions. Now, the case is at x equal to 0, boundary condition t equal to t naught, along with theta equal to theta naught, t naught minus t infinity. Second condition is not the same. Previous case, it is insulated and here heat transfer is happening. So heat transfer happens here on angle. Whatever heat is being conducted and what uh, conducted towards the tip will be convected through this tip. So that condition will be applied. That is at x equal to length L. You will be applying the energy balance between conducted heat and convected heat. Then you will be getting minus K into cross sectional area AC into dt by dx at x equal to L. This will be equated to the convective heat transfer which is H into AC into the uh, temperature which is T at x equal to L minus T infinity. So, even we have condition dt and all the other we have to do this. This is the first boundary condition. Then, second boundary condition will be, uh, will be obtaining like at the x equal to L. This this condition will be becoming minus k into ac into dt by dx in where any d theta by dx here. So it is d theta by dx at x equal to L equal to h into ac into t at x equal to L minus t infinity which is the excess temperature variable at x equal to L. This is the theta at x equal to L and L and theta L and L. So, either and do one boundary conditions. If you are applying these boundary conditions in this uh, general solution, which is this theta equal to z1 in d raised to mx plus c2 in d raised to minus mx, then you will be getting the solution. And that final solution I will be writing here, which is uh, t minus t infinity divided by t naught minus t infinity. Along with t minus t infinity in any theta no idea. and this t naught minus t infinity in I can write it as theta naught which is equal to you are having that expression which is cos h m into l minus x near theta and plus or extra term varim, plus h by m k into sin h ml minus x adum hyperbolic function on divided by cos h ml plus h by mk second term h by mk into sin h ml Everybody, cos and sin hyperbolic functions on this is the temperature distribution and you are having the uh, you have to calculate the heat transferred by the fin also for this third case where the case is uh, convection is happening across the tip then you will be getting q fin equal to nertal tepala square root of hp k into ac into t naught minus t infinity into baki terminal on it which is tan HML plus H divided by MK 
the whole divided by 1 plus h by mk into tan hml. This is the heat transfer. So, here and equation is not the same. Later, if you are applying the boundary conditions, if you are applying, then you will be getting this as the solution. Where this is the temperature variable or distribution, and this is the heat, total heat transferred by the fin for this case. In this case, data I will be showing you uh, in the fin chapter, third case, short fin within brackets ends not insulated, means heat transfer is happening across the tip, where this is the temperature uh, variable that is t minus t infinity divided by t naught t naught along with tb naana data book ila base temperature tb minus t infinity equal to this expression and this is the heat transferred thank you